Hello, my bitches, guys. Welcome to a brand new video. Today, I'll be reacting to Lucifer season six, episode three. In the last episode, uh, Ella and Carol were like, you know, they're going on a date. It was very, very cute. We really got a good insight into Carol and Ella and what their relationship could be. And like, they're just both, I feel like, rays of sunshine. So I feel like they're going to compliment each other like a lot. I feel like, actually, I feel like Carol grounds Ella a little bit. We know Alec can get really like energetic and hyper and happy, so like, maybe he can agree. Like, I don't know. They're just they, it's like uh, they're a right fit for each other, you know. They have a new Lucifer and Chloe like in the police department, you know. Anyways, I'm rambling. That happened. Um, some angel went to see Dan in hell. That girl, she's an angel, and she's like, "I want you. I can help you escape hell. You can either bring you back to Earth or whatever. I need you to help me find a way to kill Lucifer." Or how to get close enough to kill Lucifer. So, I don't know, man. I'm scared of what this girl's gonna do. I need to know who she is and what her game is, because I'm not okay. So, anyways, without further ado, let's just get right into this week's episode. Let's go. Wait, what, what, what is she? Linda? Is she writing a... What is it? A, what is it? Like a book or something? Ah, Doctor, sorry to interrupt. Wait, she's writing about her time in Lucifer. She's writing about her experience. She's writing like a, no, you know, one of those like novel, uh, one of those books. She's writing a book, a novel. Well, not a novel, you know. A thing about it. Her experience with Lucifer. What was it called? Sympathy for the Devil? I love that. No, but seriously. How do I feel about that? I mean, go off! I support it. No. Well, it didn't work because I ended up caring for him. So, <laughs> back to square one. Those details might be enlightening. Wait. For you. Girl. Of course. She's so, she is playing him. Okay. <laughs> well, a uh, record producer was trying to profit from Delilah's death. Tell me about him. Oh, well, he was a vile, horrid little man. I don't want to fall into the trap of caring about someone again, so who better to help than someone I hate? Oh, Doctor, you're a genius. <laughs> Totally oh my god. Really bad advice. She literally did nothing. And well, he's just like... Well, why was he horrid? Do you remember anything else about the case? <laughs> Linda, honey. She's sussing information because she's trying to like recall all her like times with this from, from the very beginning. Obviously, it's like it's been a while. So it's going to be like she's forgetting some details. But I told you last, was it last week or the week before that I love how Lucifer sees ghosts to Linda but then comes up with these crazy schemes on his own that actually kind of could work. You know? And Linda, like, just sits there and just, like, listens to him. I, I just think it's great. I don't know. I love it. I love it. Oh, she kept the frog. Where else would I be? It could be tied to something big. Really big. Like the end of the world. Something mind, body, and soul altering. Unless you really want to know. I, I respect your privacy, Miss Lopez. No, tell him, because he needs to know. Says I'm working on something very important myself. And I found him, but, well, see for yourself. Maybe it's best if I put Amenadiel's necklace back in the... I think it could be a in the good safe. idea. No, 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 okay. but seriously, though. The, it's been, it's episode three, right, and she... Episode one, she had she got she had it in her hand and she hit the guy. You know, she got the suspect. Episode two, she was having sex with Lucifer using it. Like, I feel like she's getting too comfortable using this, and maybe she likes this power. I, I hope I'm not reading into anything. Like, I'm hoping it, it. I hope she doesn't get addicted to the power. You know. I'm oh, I'm I'm scared because I keep bringing it up and I keep showing it. So I don't know, man. I'm in, I am going to help Jimmy Barnes of all people. <laughs> Jimmy Barnes? <laughs> the same Jimmy Barnes who killed your friend? I know that too, so I'm just going to pop down to hell to see him. It's almost easier this way, really. Oh, oh shit! Okay. So when do we leave? Bring her! Don't be shy! Da -na 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 -na. <laughs> yes! Bring Chloe down there. Do you reckon if Chloe goes down there with Lucifer, if she says... Can she visit Dan, though? But will Dan be there? Because if the angel took him, maybe this is how they'll find out that Dan's not in hell anymore. Because the angel took him, I don't know. Well, this is a terrible idea. Worst I've heard since some genius decided to cancel Bones. What? <laughs> that show was the perfect combination of... Probably because mortals can't go down there. Not where they're alive, anyway. So, why don't you go home, put your feet up. I'll pop this back in... No! 
Oh, hello. Uh, That's concerning. Shouldn't it help me survive a trip to hell, you know? Well... She's lying. Actually, yes, I suppose it would, but... I'm no, 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 she's lying. See, she has, she's getting addicted to it. It's like, it's like a drug, you know? She has an addiction to the power. She doesn't want to let it go. Now she's kind of using this, the excuse of like, you know, help me in hell, which like it could. It would. So it's like a safe, you know? But, Chloe, honey, be careful. I don't want anything to happen. I'm scared. You know, protection. We are partners, aren't we? Oh, yes, you are. I know, you are. That we are. I will never get tired of that. Ah! The bridal carry we fucking deserve. Look at it! Oh, they're so hot. They're such a hot couple, you know. Like, they're gorgeous. And, like, you know him putting his wings out turns her on. You know it does! You know it does. Oh. Is everything I needed this? Fuck, watch this be my thumbnail. I'm not even joking. Oh, oh shit. I'm back. Oh, shit! Yeah, okay. There's a, there's, a, there's, a, there's a crazy angel here. She's gonna kill you. Oh, he there's tried to danger. double cross her. Evil, mean, murder angel. Ruin your plan. No, honey, stop. Oh, my God. I can't believe if they just waited one second longer, they would have seen Dan. Now he's back. Is he alive now? Is he, like, actually back alive? Holy shit. Are you serious? What if Trixie sees? I'm stressed. What the hell? I'm not doing well. Can we come back? Oh, okay. He's a spirit. I guess. A ghost. In the land of the living, and you, uh, aren't. Okay, he's not alive. Your body is warm food. Why didn't you tell me you were going to betray me? <laughs> That's different. Yeah, whatever. I'd say pull up a chair, but, you know. <laughs> Just kind of funny, but I hate her. I don't know. What is that? That's his throne. Old it's, throne. It's my throne. Yeah. It looks so lonely. Oh, honey. It was. <laughs> it. it was. Do you see how they're holding hands the whole time? I love them. They're holding hands the whole time. See, maybe this will be good for Chloe to kind of give him some, some perspective on what Lucifer ha went through when he was in hell, like, as the king. Like, he was just lonely, like... And now look at them! The development is real. Be careful. Oh, look at him in his own uniform! I'm looking for him in a deal. That's it. That's me. Oh, look at him in his little uniform! He looks so good. Oh my god, he's finally like, it's his first day. Bless his soul. That's your full name. I mean, I know that's not your full name. He's such an idiot. I love him so much. What the fuck? <laughs> I knew you were a softie. Shut your mouth, Ellen. <laughs> I'm only here to learn what I can use to make fun of him. <laughs> I mean, most of her trainees wash out. No, but even if she's this tough, Mazakine, he knows how to deal with Mazakine. So you can deal with this officer. Like, I mean, he's got this. If you can deal with Mace, he can deal with anybody, literally. He's got this. Really? Look at them though. Like I love that they're in hell together. Like, this just makes me so happy. I need control. Oh! <laughs> no, the cartoon, the animated episode. This is it. Oh, this is so cool. Cause what doesn't doesn't Jimmy do cartoons or something? I can't remember. Well, I am going to love this episode. Is my chin? But like I was gonna say this amazing in real life, but <laughs> So turning into cartoons. This no no no, this is terrible. Because you broke Jimmy Barnes' brain? I'm a smoothie. Oh! oh look! Oh. My god! Oh, I'm sure it won't stay that way. <laughs> right? So I'm a smoothie, I can't. What the I can't believe I'm saying this, but look, I, I think we need to focus. 
Hmm. <laughs> Jimmy Barnes. I crashed Jimmy's wedding. Right after you and I first met, in fact. Bless no. as a show. Anyone here who would oppose your excuse me? Oh my god, what? This is there Lucifer, right? <gasps> Lucifer, the morning star. Oh, that's absurd. And his chin definitely looks like a butt. You know what? <laughs> I love this so much. What the fuck? <laughs> I want to make the world a better place for for everyone, actually. And so I want you to know that I'm, that I'm in it for the long haul. Hey, thanks for coming. He caught a perp spraying some pretty foul graffiti. Okay, we'll take him. What are you doing? What are you doing? I'm scared. I want cartoon case to do just that, and not the one on my bloody chin. But do the doors normally disappear? Oh, the door's gone. Um, I don't feel the normal control I have in hell. Oh, shit, are you trapped? What are you saying? You're trapped. I think we may be trapped in here. Will you go talk to him, Jimmy? Go talk to him if you're trapped. I won't stand for this. He's doing something on purpose. <gasps> <laughs> They're really just breaking the fourth wall here. I love it. Go. <laughs> oh, it's uh, yeah. There's nothing, nothing down there. <laughs> Girl. <laughs> well, if we stabilize him mentally, maybe you can regain control of his hello. Hey. Did you like his chest hair? Because I could grow out a tough like that if you. No, I'm good. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, that's hilarious. <laughs> She's like, no, thank you. Nice, no, thank you. <laughs> I gotta say, the the animators, whoever did this episode, like the animation part, have done such a great job. Like, I'm getting Looney Tunes vibes. Like, you know, it's bringing me back to when I was a kid. You know, you got to watch the Looney Tunes. Like, it was nice, you know? When I had no worries, when I had no worries in the world, sitting on the couch and living my life on a Saturday morning, watching the kids' animation shows, living for that literally. This takes me back. Well done, Tamla, we'll add to the animators. Baldy. <laughs> you look strong and very ready for battle. And win any fight. <laughs> they probably cry when they see Listen, you Listen, I know her. No, you don't. Days? Random dude I've never met. Crazy plan of hers to somehow make me look good? <laughs> well, she made you look good by committing vandalism, which is illegal. Oh, <laughs> girl. It is just this. Armed robbery. Oh, that sounds nice. Then murder. Been there, done that. She's kidding. I don't kid. Go this to is catch criminals, so they got one and we're taking her to prison. She's harmless. Mostly. <laughs> I'm in it, honey. Once a criminal, always a criminal. Oh. I mean, if you don't know that, then maybe you're not cut out for this job. No, but I don't think that's true. I will never think that way. Okay, I respect that. I hope so. Oh. Stop. Seems like you're going through some stuff. There's good people here. They might be able to give you the help you need. Oh, bless her soul. That's not, that was really nice. I thought you were supposed to be tough. This. Is police work. I like that so much, you know. I really like that. No, but this is... Where's she going? No, but... I don't believe the ones are criminal always are criminal. I believe people can change. Like, everyone deserves second chances, you know? I mean, May is used to be a demon who used to kill and torture people, and now she's a bounty hunter married, getting married to Eve. Like, people change, you know? And it's good that Amanda has that mentality. And I'm, I think... What's her name? Sonia, Sonia, whatever her name is, like, is like I respect that because like you know, Mendel's you know it's his first day kind of thing like on his first field day. He's like it's innocent, like he you know, he's excited, but like once you find out what's really out there and like you know the shit that happens, like I don't know how he's but I hope he keeps that mentality because I think re this world really needs that men um, that mentality. Anyways, that was the end of my part reaction. I check out my part two reaction. Go click the link in the description box below. And I'll see you guys over there. Ciao for now. Bye, guys.